great. That's great. Thank you very much. Great. Okay. Um, first off, I just want to thank um, Business Agility Community for inviting me to come along and speak. It, it's a real pleasure and an honor to be here. And some of the conversations and some of the talks that we've had uh, today and yesterday, I, I think are just really exceptional. Business agility doesn't care about agile. Okay. <laughs> but agile should care about business agility. They're two different things. It's a really important issue. I see companies now wanting solutions to their problems when they haven't defined what their problems, so they'll say, we'll go and do Scrum, we'll go and do Agile, we'll go and do this. Why? Well, everybody's doing it. OK, that is the blind leading the blind. So I'm going to talk about bu business agility. It's about embracing continuous change and continuous value creation, not just continuous production. So let's have a look at what this work climate means. Let's just dig into that a little bit. The work climates are the thinking, feelings, and perceptions of managers, staff, and the leaders. Their combined thinking is in response to the way the organization is set up. All right, what we have here, the four types of organization, we have the industrial model and we have the adaptive model. Engaging, learning, leading, and adapting down the bottom. This turned out to be like a manufacturing company. Every organization needs to create four capabilities. What I do with them is I help them learn how to design these organizations. I help them learn how to change them from a leadership point of view. I help them learn how to adopt the new business practices the new strategies, or whatever, because it's not the same as a make and sell. Thank you very much.